With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Find the value of angle A plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D plus angle E. So those ang angles are A, B, C, D and E. And uh, first of all, we should mention interior angle, interior angle as uh, U. This angle is V, W. This will be X and this will be Y. Okay, so we are considering all the angles, interior angles. And uh, according to the formula, sum of all, sum of all interior angles in any polygon interior angles in any polygon is equals to interior angles in any polygon is equals to n minus 2 into 180 is equals to n minus 2 into 180 as you can see it's a, a continuous pentagon okay because all the sides are exactly equal okay and uh, pentagon that that means five sides so five minus two into 180 and uh, 3 into 180 will be equals to 540 so this is equation number one and uh, for second thing we have to yeah then after we have to consider triangles because there are five triangles so first triangle will be like this so we have to name all the sides so that we can understand everything okay so angle this point will be a side b c side d side e and then after we can name it as u v capital w capital x and capital y okay and now we are going to write it down in terms of triangle so in triangle udb as we can see so we are going to consider triangle like this okay u d and b so as you can see there are five triangles we can make from x and from w from v from u and y okay so in triangle in triangle udb we can write down angles and property in this triangle that means angle u plus angle d plus angle b is equals to 180 degree by angle sum property and then after in triangle next triangle we can take from v vce or vec we can say in triangle vec we can simply say angle v e and angle c so angle v plus angle e plus angle c is equals to 180 degree again by angle sum property and then we can take triangle w d a okay so clockwise we can consider w d a so in this triangle we can write it down similar angle w plus angle d plus angle a is equals to 180 again by angle sum property as we can see because sum of all the angles in any triangle is equals to 180 degree and uh, next uh, we can take XEB so in triangle in triangle XEB we can take angle X plus angle E plus angle B is equals to 180 degree by angle sum property and we can equation 1 sorry this one must be equation 2 equation 3 equation 4 equation 5 okay then after the last triangle should be angle yac so in triangle yac we can say angle y plus angle a angle y plus angle a plus angle c is equals to 180 degree and again by angle sum property okay so this is equation 6 so now we have to add all the equations equation second from equation second to 
six. So add equation two, equation three, equation four, equation five, and equation six. Then after adding all of them, we will get as we can see, like sum of all interior, we will get u v x plus y. So we will get after adding all of them angle u plus angle v and uh, then angle w plus angle x plus angle y so this is angle y and uh, plus angle y bracket close and as we can see every single exterior angle like a b c d e those angles are repeating twice so we can directly write it down as twice of angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle d plus angle e and if you are going to add all the rhs then 180 into 5 so this will be equals to 180 degree into 5 okay so this portion just look at this portion u v w x y is equals to 540 degree okay why 540 because they are telling sum of all interior angles is equals to that means angle u plus angle v plus angle w plus angle x plus angle y is equals to 540 so we can easily replace like from equation 1 from equation 1 we can replace this by 540 degree that means 540 degree plus twice of bracket angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle d plus angle e and is equal is to 900 degree and now we have to take this 900 to rhs so twice of angle a plus angle b and plus angle c plus angle d plus angle e bracket close is equals to 900 minus 540 and uh, then after we have to take this two to rhs in division so angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle d plus angle e is equals to 360 which is 900 minus uh, 540 and divided by 2 and this will be equals to 180 degree so this is our final answer angle a plus angle b plus angle c plus angle D plus angle E is equals to 180 degree. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.